I feel very lucky to be back at Birmingham, the original Red Brick University as Vice-Chancellor. Some of you may know that I've previously worked here as Pro Vice-Chancellor for Research and then Provost. Much has changed over the five years I've been away. This is most visible in the development of the campus, but it's what those changes make possible that really excites me. For example, our collaborative teaching laboratory enables STEM students to work together across different subjects and our Institute of Translational Medicine is turning scientific discoveries into medical reality for patients. Students have been hit hard by the pandemic at a key moment in their lives. We're doing everything we can to support them while helping them make the most of the resilience and the adaptability they've developed over the last two years. And as many alumni have supported students through scholarships and hardship funds, our students have paid your generosity forward by volunteering their time to help their local community. Sustainability is hugely important to me. We need to help make sure the young people we're educating have a world they can thrive in and give them the tools to fight for our planet. For example, we've just become the first university in the world to teach climate change as part of our accountancy and finance degree, a key area of business where sustainability and the bottom line need to work together. And we've just launched free resources to help schools put sustainable fashion centre stage in the classroom. We're reflecting this commitment equally in our research, responding to the global environmental emergency and embedding sustainability into the way that we operate. Right now, our researchers are at the cutting edge of everything from low carbon heating technologies for our homes and our workplaces to discovering how trees will respond to climate change. We're also responding rapidly to needs around the world, including making childbirth safer, finding new treatments for cancer, and involving young people directly in developing support for mental health. We have further work to do to create an inclusive community with a diverse range of voices and experiences at all levels. The UK has very few black professors and universities continue to have an ethnicity and a gender pay gap. We know more than ever about how to support neurodivergent people, those with disabilities and everyone's mental health. We must further adapt our learning and our research to work effectively for everyone. We need every brilliant person available to work on the big problems facing our communities and as role models for the next generation of students. We are applying to become a University of Sanctuary and we will significantly increase the number of Sanctuary scholarships for refugee students from one a year to five. For those from Ukraine, we have introduced a package of support for our current students, for displaced students this year and for students who want to study at Birmingham in the future. We are also supporting displaced academics and have a partnership with the Ukrainian University. Alumni like you take what you've learned at Birmingham out into the world to make a real difference every day. You are our best ambassadors. From the USA to Hong Kong, you're building futures, you're helping others, and you're developing the breakthroughs that the world needs. So many of you are extremely generous in supporting students and research whether giving your time or funding scholarships and researchers. You represent many of the best things about Birmingham. I can't wait to meet you in person.